Little Steps is a nonprofit organization in the upstate of South Carolina working with young parents and teens in our community. We are essentially working to encourage them, hold them accountable, but more importantly, make them feel welcome in an environment where they can become more accountable and more confident through our programming. Our executive director and founder, Mandy Black, created this organization in 2005. She was a young parent herself, and she saw the need in the community and that there were gaps that weren't being fulfilled. Essentially, uh, she said that she never wanted to start a nonprofit organization. She never would have imagined doing that, but she just wanted to help people. She actually started by helping young couples in the community during her lunch breaks while she was working for a corporate organization. And then she realized she had to do this and created the organization. It really hit its stride in 2010 when organizations like New Spring helped us to get a new facility to keep up with our capacity and the demand in the community. And now we are able to help over 100 young families every year. What was really important for our executive director was that we had evidence-based programming. So essentially we have three components that we use for Little Steps. The first one is nurturing parenting, which we use for our curriculum uh, during our 18 to 24 week classes with our participants. The second part is the case management with our care coordinator. She uses Triple P to help them with any issues that may come up and give them more one-on-one -on -one counseling. And then we have parent enrichment activities through the Palmetto Basics, which help our, our parents a lot. So while the South Carolina statistics, or at least the most recent statistics that we have, show that about half of teen mothers won't complete their high school education by the time that they're 22, our Little Steps participants, actually 97% of them, will go on to continue or complete their high school education, depending on how old they are when they join our program. Additionally, while the South Carolina statistics show that about one in four teen mothers will have a repeat pregnancy while they're a teenager, only about 2% of Little Steps participants have a repeat pregnancy while they're still teens. One thing that we really need right now is volunteers. We've had a lack of that because of the pandemic, but now we're starting to feel more comfortable bringing in volunteers. So by going to our website, people can find out how to volunteer and even how to donate as well.